Okay, today we are talking about the most niche thing on the entire planet. We are talking about Ibis. Now, I have this thought that Lumix has the best Ibis. And there's a lot of videos online where people claim that Lumix cameras like the S5 have the best looking footage and most stable looking footage because of the Ibis that's built into the camera. Now I thought it would be fun to test that today and answer the question, does Lumix actually have the best Ibis and compare it against three of the other top models in its class? And I thought what better place to test that then in a 2007 Robinson R44 helicopter with our good friends Becky and Chris. What it's worth, the 2007 model shakes the same as the 2023 model. Just, just, just so you're not, <laughs> no, no, so, no. So, so you're not afraid. I really needed to point out that it was a 2007. 2007 Sounded shakier. <laughs> All right, doctor, what's the situation today with the wind? Are we gonna get some, some shake? The recent wind assessment at Buffalo International is 17 gusting 28 knots. You want shakes, you want bumps, <laughs> this is the day to do it. <laughs> the, the ultimate test. We'll, we'll start with some of the, the easier ones. We'll do some tripod style shots and then we'll move into what is going to be the ultimate shaky situation. All right, I'm gonna go and set up these other cameras that I have. I'll show you, I'll show you what the lineup is. All right, so our first camera is the Lumix S5 with the 24 to 70 f 2.8 lens. Up next, we have... The second camera is the Sony a7... Four. Four. With the G Master f 2.8, 24 to 70. <laughs> the next camera in our lineup is the Nikon Z6 Mark II with the 24 to 70 f/4 lens. And our last camera, we got a beefy camera right here, the Canon R5 with the 20 to 70 f/2 big boy lens right here so and that is our lineup so we're trying to make it fair i tried to keep all the cameras somewhat similar here and we're just going to have a whole comparison a little showdown a little battle all these cameras Why this did you is bring so this many? is chaos it was a lot of cameras That's to try so to cross the border with <laughs> it is a lot of money in a bag it's gonna be between it's sony everyone. and lumix i find the sony the sony stabilization is really good but if you're not using the electronic stabilization, then it's a toss up. I have no idea. I gotta go with the love of my life, Sony. I'm gonna be honest, I think Sony's gonna win, but I might be a little biased because I know I'm biased. I really like Sony. <laughs> I think it's all fair game now. I've never shot we're gonna We're gonna let it be unbiased. We're just gonna show the footage as is. Okay, so we're gonna start with some like tripod style shots and then we're gonna do a tracking shot. Up first, we are going to do the Lumix S5. All right, so now it's time. Nikon Z6, Mark II, 24 to 70. Let's get some shots. And last but not least, Sony a7 IV, 24 to 70. Now we're gonna do a tracking shot, literally handheld, no straps. Following Chris, going to the helicopter. Let's see what that's like.
Okay, now we're gonna go up in the helicopter. I'm just gonna shoot a giant sequence with all of the different cameras, and in the bottom corner here, we're gonna reveal which camera each one is by going three, two, one. I think that'll be fun. Light is getting low. They're antsy to get up in the helicopter right now. Okay, now we can go fly. Okay. Finally! <laughs> I'm sorry I picked four cameras. I should pick two. Yeah. Just in one comparison, not all these big cameras. All right, it's time to go flying. What's our route, two, sir? Two minutes until sunset. <laughs> <laughs> the sun is two minutes off the horizon. We got the video filmed, right? Where do you guys want to go? We can just do like a tour down to Buffalo. I want to be in the sky. We can just, she doesn't care. <laughs> Let's go to Niagara Falls and back. How's yeah. that sound? Ooh, we're getting the Niagara Falls tour. It's funny because like Niagara Falls is just like, ah, I don't go to Niagara Falls. But, like, <laughs> we've done it so many times. Isn't it one of like the natural wonders yeah. of the world yeah. or something? I don't know, I don't, even know. I don't know anything about where I live. But yeah, all right, Niagara Falls it is. Let's go. I'm gonna let you decide which footage you thought was the most stable in the comments section below. And while you're down there, please press like for the algorithm. That stuff actually makes a difference. Subscribe to Becky and Chris and Lizzie Pierce, and I will leave a link to the ultimate camera rig right here. I've already figured out which is the most stable. Now I'm gonna find the other features.